A bittersweet farewell today to a beloved friend and co-worker here at CBS2. Reporter John Slattery was laid to rest following an emotional standing room only funeral in Westchester County. CBS2's Tony Aiello helps us remember. A weight of sorrow shouldered by some of John Slattery's closest friends for a funeral that filled his parish church to capacity. John's voice often filled this church where he served as a lector. Tuesday at his funeral, the first reading from the book of Proverbs could not have been more fitting. Blessed is the man for whom a good family lives. Blessed is the man whose strength is enhanced by his tenderness, whose wisdom is based on his faith. Monsignor Thomas Petrillo pointed out John Slattery didn't dabble in his Catholic faith. He lived it daily, and he felt particularly blessed by the sacrament of marriage. Yes, God permitted John to meet Susie, the bride he would love more and more with each passing day of their marriage. Their union lasted more than 40 years. She is heartbroken. She's lost her best friend, but she will go on and she, she's a rock. The service featured John's favorite hymns and ended with a eulogy from his son, Patrick, who joked about inheriting his dad's looks, but not his way with words. My dad would be blown away by the amount of kindness, support, and love everyone has shown over the past few days. He would not have believed it, and he would, would have said it must have been a slow news day for so much of it. Patrick spoke of his dad's quirky habits and irreverent sense of humor, calling him an enormous ham who loved his annual turn on stage for the Inner Circle show. I'm that famous Russian stud in control and out for blood. It was just an outpouring of love and joy and just the brilliance of being on the stage and moving and making people happy. John Slattery, devoted to his family, to his faith and to the highest standards of his craft. Illegal, yeah, you can't use this as a through street. Did you know that it's illegal here? New York is at a loss now because he told stories for our viewers and he was their eyes, he was their ears, he was their advocate and a piece of that is now missing. Eternal rest grant unto him, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine. John Slattery, his gifts were many and so too the lives he touched.